On target one. Please welcome back James Mason. James and on target two, Carl okay. Thomas Broad. And Kai today comes from Birmingham. The line judge is Tim Harris. You know, Kai's made some life changes recently to make sure that he can train as much as possible. So um, we'll be looking to make the most of the fact that he's been uh, putting a lot of work in this year. Nine points. Very nice start. That breeze looks to have settled down again. Flags looking nice and still just now. Which means the conditions have changed since both of them shot their first match. Ten points. Looked like a little bit of a wobble on his shot there, but he got a nice ten out of it. Ten points. Right, this is his first one. Nine points. So both gents sharing twenty nine for the first end. A very nice first uh, percent, twenty nine apiece. Anyone's wondering while we're looking at the target face there, the, um, there's two rings, uh, both of them scoring a 10. For this kind of competition, we don't seem to differentiate between. Ten. So anything in that uh, circle with the 10 beside it all scores 10 points. And then you can see each of the coloured rings afterwards and their respective points. Ten points. In these circumstances, that, that very inner ring, the X ring, is only relevant if they... Um, if they're trying to achieve a world record. Nine points. And once again, all so time. Tied up again after that second end. Piece. No line cutters here. Very, uh, very clean shooting from both of them. Keeping these uh, these tens coming. Prior to the, that arrow, both athletes sitting on 58 of a possible 60. 10 9 liner. It's hard to tell if that's broken from here. We'll find out soon. Nine points. Just a little look of disapproval on his face as that shot went there. He wasn't entirely happy with it. So he's having to, to force a lot of those shots through at the moment. Both athletes are taking a little bit longer to get these shots off. Nine points. Just the bows moving a little bit more. Tension rising for them. Ten. That's a better shot. Next quick hit. Shot that time and that paid off for him. Now I reckon James's first arrow is in. So um, we're just waiting for a value time. on that first nine there, After which I, nine, from here it looks in, but only the judge can tell. Sure. 
and four out of five. Neither archer willing to give up a, a single point to the other. Nine. Nine points. Both starting with a nine there. Ten nine liner. Yeah, that's broken the ten, so. Yeah, I agree. It's a better shot from Kyle, though perhaps it hadn't quite settled enough very quick uh, in comparison to his other shots. Ten nine liner. Forced that one through a little bit there, but. I think it's broken the 10. Yeah. Both athletes just mirroring each other's shots here. Well, it's slightly wide, but it's into the 9 there. And that's a 10. Ah, uh, 10 there, okay. So we're waiting for some arrow values so here, but looks like it pulled. looks like James might have made a Narrowly. point up on this match here. I think all the line cutters are going to be called in. We do still have one arrow left of this, uh, uh, one, one end left of this match, so it's not all over yet, and in fact it could be, could flip completely the opposite way. James we never really know. Kai and his coach. And Kai going first yet again. That was like a very nice shot from him. Yeah, he's just nailed that. Ten points. And James responds with a pretty much identical arrow there. You just cannot separate these two. Ten points. Ten points. Kind of doing what he needs to do. I think he's found his rhythm a bit more now. Has James. James as well. Okay, this final arrow will decide. Ten. Longer hold there. Doing everything he can to make the best shot. Yeah, he knew he needed a ten. Mm. But it was an eight. He wasn't happy with that. James now needs eight. So an eight or higher will get the win for James here. And it's Which a he does with a 30. From James Mason. A very nice way to go to that match. match.